Busters! Bustin makes you feel good. We got the Fuck Ralph Festival kind of thing going on. Fuck Ralph Festival with DSP. With DSP. We're going to introduce Phil to DSP's lore now. I'm just going to be warning you guys right now. Ralph's lore. (laughs) We're not going to get through all of Ralph's lore today. There's 48 folders. I'm aiming to get through Gamergate, and I'm trying to get to Knoxville today. (laughs) We'll, We'll see. There's a lot of stuff there. Killing dogs, fucking his 20th birthday. Negative clap. Gamergate, Master Milo. There's so... Porn star calling his penis micro penis. Yeah, the, the there's, porn star with his micro penis. There's, so... there's a lot of stuff there. But before we get into that, we got Dark Side Phil's top 10 most racist, racist moments. moments. Dark Side Phil is going to be with us to count down his top 10 moments. Now, you think, oh, some detractor made this, some A log. Ma- no. No. Phil, it was Phil. Phil. Phil made this himself. He made his top 10 most racist moments. It's so keto. <laughs> Phil, like, you, I'm not going to spoil it, but the way the numbers change. It's wild. It's so funny, dude. <laughs> You're going to want to tune in early. I remember hitting play and being like, oh. We might get melted for this. <laughs> oh, I don't know. We're Dark, good. Side We're good. Phil. Dark Side Phil was on one. He was trying to top like Richard Spencer, <laughs> Adolf Hitler, Nick Fuentes. Not that good. He's up there in like top five greatest racists of all time there. It's some goaded racism. No, we, we have, it's so fucking funny. You guys are going to die. so funny. Guys, then we've got Review Tech USA. Oh, yeah. oh, well, okay. Let's do Review Tech quick. Review Tech USA's funeral. Today, he deleted the Review Tech USA channel. No! I mean, yes. Let's Uncle rules. Rich. Let's go. Uncle, we um, win the casino we win. one. Let's you go. lose. Bring it uh, up. Woo. But Local Live tore into Dickers, just buried. The, I've never seen Boogie actually cut a promo that was good. Me. He did it. He Wait, bring it up. Boogie dubbed like three, no, it's crazy. three in a row. And Wings too. And and Keem was vicious. Ooh. They put the fucking boots to him. And I think that's why he finally laid the channel to rest. Um, He did like a suicide note as well, which we're going to cover. He did like a whole video saying that Rich was dead, which he's obviously not dead. But he's, he's like in like, Silent Hill now. Like faking his own death. <laughs> To try and avoid the shame of being felted by Boogie to <laughs> nine and eight. It's tough. It's like the Pauly Shore. Tough. Remember that Pauly oh. Shore movie? Vickers <laughs> had like a complete and utter fucking mental breakdown that is too much for one show. I so, I sat there oh, eight hours. On Saturday, we're doing the eight hour Dickers meltdown spectacular. So yeah. just stay tuned Saturday for that. May I just then, say one thing, guys? Um, I... I am now, like, in my sleep, my dreams, I hear the applause sound effect. I'm not even kidding. Every minute. Woo! I'm like, it's- I hear it now. I'm, in, I'm taking a piss, and I hear it. Anyway, the way, Cog. Cog content, we're feasting. Beyond. We're feasting Woo! on the Cog content. He's actually He's there right at the start of the show because we're going to get into the Cog content. Guys. He's lost it. He is literally has chosen... To become an actual beggar. A bum. So his, his idea is he hasn't made enough bagging online. So he's actually going to one day out of the week go out and stream himself begging in the gutter. No joke. Dressed like a bum. For money. For money with a tin cup that he shakes. He thinks this is the new grift, the new path forward. We're not even kidding. I think he should do it. I no, think he needs dangerous. the wheelchair. We're going to... We're gonna do well, the wheel- yes, the wheelchair grift. So let's set a wheelchair goal, guys. Yeah. Let's get Cog a wheelchair so he can fake being disabled. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. maximize his IRL beggars. It's never been done. <laughs> so far as I know, nobody has ever actually sat down streaming themselves begging on the sidewalk. 
Only at, only on Kogav. And, and also... Only in Dudley, only in Grimsby can you get content that fucking keto. He, he also um, admits, he admits, he he provides no commentary. Oh, it's He's docile. Cool. And he's now he's like so it's like, brutal. And then and then he literally falls. sleeps on stream. He falls asleep. The on style Kong. It's the weed Kong. Oh, it's the fucking weed. Like, whoa. Did we get some dick. He's like copy Dicker's blueprint. That's so funny. After he promised to be higher energy and provide more commentary, he literally went to sleep watching Harvey <sighs> Birdman. Uh, Groiper War is failing again. Nick's oh. totally embarrassed. I don't know if we'll get to it if we have time. We're going to be really pressed for time tonight with Phil. I it's just a wanna, jam pack. I want to set expectations correct, guys. We're probably not going to get too deep into the Ralph lore tonight with Phil. It'll start, though. It's going to be a recurring segment where I try and comprehensively, we try and comprehensively explain to Phil the entirety of the Ralph lore. Oh, by the way, new Ralph, Corinne and him are having domestics. Oh, yeah, we got to show... I mean, we're going to show Phil first. We're going to show Phil the Corinne saga with Ralph. The, the coming, the coming. Saga, and then we're going to get into the lore. So, I mean, listen, it's a jam-packed show tonight. <laughs> this one I'm really excited for. It's a good one. Uh, we'll see you there. And Silent Hill after. Soon. Silent Hill after only on Kick. Kick. Peace.